du fang Kan der bys i blå Hello everybody, I'm Sir Blobfish Welcome to the unboxing of these deck of cards that I managed to score at a local arcade called Time Zone. Now, obviously you know how arcades work, you go around, play some games, you get tickets and then you can trade those tickets in. Now, um, I got a red version of this deck but I decided I was going to unbox the blue version because banter. And I have the red version, um, you know, I have a, I have a pretty good collection of cards, there's a picture of that. And um, yeah, there's my red deck. Now. Anyway, as you can see, this is like a nice golden finish on the stock case. It's got some, uh, I believe that's Asian. Okay, I'm not sure which country or region of Asian language that is, but it's some sort of Asian. Um, but yeah, they these are drone playing cards, as you can see. I'm <clears throat> assuming you could read, and um, club special, bam. Um, they're definitely not the club special, but whatever all right so where's the uh seal thing okay, so you've got to open right there <clears throat> i've never actually opened these before as you can tell because there's still the seal on them oh my voice there eh. all right there we go got them open just pull that around like that you got the top off now all right so what you gonna do? Just do that. Oh my god. I'm, I'm doing this like a how to video. Uh, how do you get this open there? Ah. Try not to break the, the, the top case because I can feel that it's a very. I can feel that it's a very fragile top case, so I don't want to break it. Oh, then that's not coming off ever. Oh, never mind. Okay, we got it. So this is what. Oh, it actually feels really good. So this is what it looks like without the thing. It's like got like a met metallic finish on it. Wow, uh, it's really cool. Alright, so I'll uh, just pop this open. If I can. Oh, this is what decks of cards are usually like. First time you open them, it's just impossible. Usually break them. Ah, stick my finger in there. There we go. Okay, got them open. Barely even broke. Alright, so this is actually pretty cool. Um, eh. Whoa, they're borderless. No freaking way, guys. They're borderless. I ain't got no borders. Sweet. Oh, they fan out really good, too. And I know that was a bad fan, but considering that I'm looking into a camera and unboxing this, it's a little bit hard for me to uh, do this. Now, a lot of you, um, people who know me in real life, you'll know that I'm a, I do magi magic as a hobby. I, um, yeah, so, I love my deck of cards. I cherish them, whether they're $3 or $300, you know, I cherish them. And considering that these things were actually pretty cheap, you know, they're good, they're good. So anyway, as you can see, guys, they are borderless, they have like a, Almost a David Blaine feel to it on the back. Oh, okay. So here's the um, here's the top card. It's not an actual card. It's just some um, uh, not sure what language that is. We've got the drone and yeah. So that's cool. All right. So put that one aside. Let's check out the jokers. Um. Okay. So here's the first joker. That's cool. And then the other Joker should be on the back. No, where's the other Joker? But does it only come with one Joker? Hang on. I can't find the other Joker. Is there another Joker at all? <laughs> There's only one Joker? Are you kidding me, right? What is this? There's no Jokers. Um, well, that was interesting. There are literally no jokers. I thought, I thought it would be on the back or something. Um, that card's the, um, that card, and, no, nah? wow. Hang on, is there a 10? I don't think there's a 10 either. 
Wait, no, there is a tent. Sweet. Oh, that's weird. There's no, there's only one joker. That sucks. Wait, must be. Ah, oh, still in the top case. I was gonna say like that's crazy. Okay, so we got the second joker here. As you can see, they have like a, a king. They have the the king. Is that a king or a, a jack? I'm not sure, but it's one of one of the uh, the king of the jack with a like a bumblebee type thing. It's the name of the drone. We got a color joker and a black and white joker. I really like the idea of identical jokers because that makes it a lot easy easier in the magic industry. You know, if you want to do a swap, then you won't notice it. Like if I just did that and then did that, um, you wouldn't really notice that I swapped them. Which is kind of obvious. Alright, now let's take a look at the court cards. Damn, these fan out really well. Alright, so. Turn this this way a little bit. Yeah, sorry for the bad audio, guys. It's actually raining outside. And, um. Yeah, so. This is what the, uh. One of the kings look like. I believe all the kings have different faces on them, which I really do like. It's a good idea. So, um. So, yeah, here's two kings, for example. Um, two kings. Okay, hang on. Uh, if I can hold them properly. So, uh, okay. well then, just drop the entire deck. Um, yeah, so here's two kings. Um, you probably can't see that, but they are different. They do have different faces, which I like very much. Okay, so, and you got your two queens, they're different. Other than that, they're all like an average, um, oh, balls. They're all like an average deck of cards really there's nothing else to them oh yeah and ace of spades gotta take a look at the ace of spades um ace of spades here we are okay so here's the um ace of spades like your average old ace of spades it's got the really nice big spade in the middle and then it's got the name drone there as you can see so that's cool another cool thing but other than that they're literally the exact same just slightly smaller than your average deck of cards i did notice that when i unboxed them i noticed that hang on let me just go get one of my this is the this is one of my favorite decks that i usually use in magic um came out exclusive came out australia exclusive all right so i'll just put them out the deck so here's them they also fan out pretty damn well but they're a little bit bigger so um, if I just compare these two cards, you can see that um, this card's bigger than that card. So yeah, and the, also the color is a little bit weird. This one's a little bit darker. So yeah, that's cool. Anyway, so um, other than that, don't really know what else to say. Um, like if you enjoyed this video, and I might do more unboxing videos. You know, you never know. And um. So yeah, here's a here's a cool edit of something. Wow. And um yeah, be sure to like, be sure to subscribe. Um if you're new to the channel. Also leave a hate comment because you know, that's what twelveies do. But anyway, um until the next one guys, goodbye. Accue the outro.